So today we're gonna hone our plant skills because everything is really great when it's organic and natural and when you can take care of those plants yourself so you can grow anything you need. So today we're gonna do ivy. I always, everyone has a different method of doing this. This is what works for me. I take a little shoot off of um, the plant and I put it in some water that's like kind of near a window, just a little indirect light. Um, and you just leave it there for days. Some plants take longer than others. It depends, um, you know, kind of how much they need water. So if it's something that's gonna take a long time to be thirsty again, it's gonna take longer for it to grow roots most of the time. So yeah, you wait for a little, you know, little fuzzies basically. See how it has some fuzzies at the bottom there? It's hard to focus. Uh, uh, can you see now? Kinda. So yeah, it has some fuzzies, and if you look really, really close at the fuzzies, you can actually see really small shoots of little white feelers um, coming out of the bottom. So that's your root, believe it or not. And as soon as it has one of those, you can stick it in some soil. So you always dig about two digits of your finger, about an inch and a half, whatever, inch, inch and a half. Nothing too deep, right? But enough so we can stick the bottom of this into um, the soil. So I've prepared some soil in a pot with a saucer. You always want a, a hole in the bottom of your pot um, so the water can drain through the soil and it doesn't rot. Um, or create any mold because that's when you get flies and gnats and the plant itself can rot and then you've done all this work for nothing and that's just ridiculous. So um, always have a hole in the bottom of your pot. And then you want a saucer on the bottom unless it's an outside plant because it's going to collect any extra water that does come through. So now we've actually come to the time where it is going to be time to just put it in the pot and um, I know Ivy likes a little shade. I always just use like the end of a spoon or my finger but my nails are so nice right now I don't want to mess them up. So um, yeah you just stick it a dowel in you know about an inch something like that um, and then you can just wash it off and everything like that but um, take the plant out of here gently. Try not to touch the leaves too much. Um, I actually have three shoots here, so I'm gonna, they like to be together, the ivy likes to climb so they can stay together in that hole, um, and then you kind of just lightly, very lightly bring some, you know, light soil. You want it to be breathable for the plant, um, and I just like to take this water and put it right on the top because any type of shock to a plant, like all new everything will shock it. So you use the same water and it'll help it feel a little more at home. Now we're gonna find a good spot for this. 